The United States Postal Inspection Service is offering a reward of up to $100,000 to anyone with information that can lead to the arrest of the suspect who stole from various residential mailboxes in Horizon between May 9th and May 15th. ABC 7's Tony Gutierrez went to the location where the theft took place to speak with the residents from that area. He joins us live now in studio. Tony. Stephanie, for many of these residents, finding out that their mail had been stolen came as a surprise. However, finding out that their mailboxes were no longer there today and the location where they had to pick up their mail became more of a surprise. Residents of this area in Horizon could not find their mailboxes following a reward poster after their mail was stolen. Lilia Santi Esteban, whose property is in front of where the mailboxes used to be, says they should have been notified that the U.S. Postal Service was removing the mailboxes or put up a sign to tell them where to pick it up. A neighbor affected by the incident said she called the United States Postal Service and found out they had to pick up their mail at their corresponding post office located on George Dieter, which is 19 miles away a drive that usually takes 25 to 30 minutes from the location. Hay mucha gente que no tiene carro. She says not having their mailboxes is an inconvenience since many people in this area do not have access to cars. Residents in the area tell me incidents like these make them fear for their personal information since it can end up on the side of the road. Es triste porque, pues... No deben de agarrar las cosas ajenas, ¿verdad? Those affected, like Santi Esteban, told me seeing things like this worries them since private information like social security numbers, addresses, and IDs can be taken from them and used for the wrong reasons. We reached out to the U.S. Postal Inspection Service to learn more on the thefts, but we did not hear back. I also reached out to the El Paso U.S. Postal Service to find out when new mailboxes will be placed for the people in this area, but did not hear back either. I went in person to the U.S. Postal Service office located on George Dieter and was able to confirm residents from these areas could pick up their mail here, but could not get a date on when new mailboxes would be placed. Reporting live in studio, Tony Gutierrez, ABC7.